it's a shame that the architect or artist who made the drawings for the architecture in the film Fountainhead was never given any credit in the film. Yet the film is all about architecture and featuring the work of Mr. Rourke. My guess is that the architecture in the film is kind of reflective of Frank Lloyd Wright. Although Frank Lloyd Wright was not really a architect of skyscrapers. His was mainly for homes or low line structures. But nevertheless, Frank Lloyd Wright's architecture is all about rectangles. Nothing round, nothing curved. And it's just a series of plates, one on top of the other. And that's what you see in the architecture in the film, The Fountainhead, is a series of rectangles and plates, one piled on top of the other. One thing in the movie was the flat design of a skyscraper, which was later picked up in the UN building and the Seagram's building in New York City. What is interesting is that the proposal for a factory has no windows. It would actually have been better as a proposal for a casino. The movie The Fountainhead was about architecture. Yet the poor person who did the architectural drawings or renderings in the movie received no credit, as if architects are nothing.